Hey everybody, Simon here. So in my previous video, I made a review about the eSIM.me SIM card. That is a SIM card where it will allow you to add eSIM capability to an Android phone. If you haven't checked out that review, I'll leave a link in the description and also a video card at the end of this video. Now in my review, I said that the eSIM.me SIM card doesn't work on an iPhone. So after doing some additional research, I found this section on their FAQ site. It says that is eSIM.me available for iPhones and Apple devices? No, it is not. Currently, there are no plans of an eSIM.me app for iOS devices. The eSIM.me app necessary to download and manage the eSIM profiles of an eSIM.me card is available only for Android. However, users of iOS devices can use an eSIM card to read the active eSIM profile previously downloaded and activate it on an Android smartphone. So I wanted to try a little demo to see if I could get it to work on an iPhone. And here are the results. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open up the eSIN.me app on my Android phone. And I wanna make sure that I have everything all programmed properly. So you see right here, I have my Arlo eSIM loaded up into the eSIM.me SIM card. Everything's already programmed, it's already enabled. So now I'm just gonna quit the app and I'm gonna remove the SIM card from this phone. And let's see what happens. So here is the SIM card. And now it's time to put it in to the iPhone. And let's see what happens. Yeah, wait a little bit. And whoa, look at that. It's showing T-Mobile, the Eastern Battle Boss for USA, and it does roam on T-Mobile. So let's take a look. Carrier settings area. Yeah, it shows this thing called the carrier and it does show webbing. Let me see if I can just browse the internet. Yeah, looks like it's working. I'm gonna run a little quick speed test. All right, and here we go. It looks like it's running properly. So it looks like what you need to do in order for this eSIM.me card to work on an iPhone is you have to set up everything first with your Android phone first. And after that, just take out the SIM card and put it in your iPhone. And it looks like you'll be able to use whatever eSIM that's on that card. Yeah, I think depending on your on the eSIM data package that you got. Yeah, and also looks like I could I can also enable yeah hotspot tethering as well. So yeah pretty good but overall it does work on iphone once you have everything all set up using an android phone now if you want to check out the full review of the eSIM.me sim card you click on that card right there